to be a pilot since I was a little kid. So. Oh, I just decided last week. My name is Captain Willerson. Not dude, not bro, not teach, but Captain Willerson. And I am here to teach you all how to be pilots. Now, who here read the manual? Wonderful. Forget about it. Because being a successful pilot is not about what you know, it's about who you know. I'm, I'm sorry. We do need to know how to fly though, right? Yeah, but in order to be successful, you gotta hustle, all right? You gotta network. I don't think the FAA says anything about hustling or mingling. Ugh. When I was your age, I found myself in the co-pilot seat next to Carl Reinsdorf. Oh, wow. Now, halfway through that flight, he got a heart attack. And guess who landed the plane? A passenger. Anybody else? You. Nobody has any guesses at all? Someone on Reddit. You're the co-pilot, right? So probably you. No ideas. You were the co-pilot, so, yeah. so you. Who do you, who do you think of it? <laughs> we're saying you. Are you yeah. hearing that we're saying you? You're all wrong. It was me. Yeah. Oh, wow. So, but that's not a surprise. you knew how to fly. Yeah, I knew how to fly a plane, but the most important part is that I was there. Oh, I actually had a question about that. Yes. So, at the altitude that the plane starts falling, how do you ensure that the engines have enough thrust? Show up. What? Show up. Show up to the plane. Show up everywhere. You want to be the pilot who's at the airport all the time. That way, if somebody gets sick, who are they going to look to? <sighs> the person at the airport. Huh? The pilot that was assigned as alternate. They're only gonna have one person to look to. Who's it gonna be? You. Which person? I feel like we're saying the answer and you're not listening to Someone us. Someone at the airport. Just... A flight attendant who's paying attention. You. Someone that It'd be you. All right, look, we're just here to learn the rules of flying. Rules were meant to be broken. But wouldn't that mean crashing? You're afraid of rejection. Yes, you are. You're afraid. You're afraid, look at you. Say it, you fear rejection, say it. I fear rejection. Oh, he didn't have to say that. I mean, just look at Sully. He crashed, and now he's the most famous pilot in the world. I thought we were here to avoid situations like that. Wrong. You're here to learn how to be great, and greatness is about embracing failure. Make mistakes, people. Yeah, but that's putting hundreds of people at risk. Use those erasers. That's why you have an eraser. That's a pen. Yeah. That's why you have an eraser. A pen. Here's an assignment. I want you all to go out this week and fail on purpose. You want us to crash a plane on purpose? Once you crash once, you'll find out that it's not that bad and you won't be afraid of it anymore. Huh? Scaredy cat? Now, how many Instagram followers do you have? What? I don't... Come on, what? how many? A three. What? My mom, my dog, and my wife. What does that have to do with anything? Well, you can't. How are you gonna? I mean, nowadays, you need a following if you want to book any flights, son. I think you're confusing this with something else. You know what? I like the cut of your jib. You should move to Los Angeles. Because I'm going to tell you what, I don't care how good of a pilot you are, you're not going to get discovered in Louisville. Wait a minute. You're the guy from the, the commercials, the Pan Am commercials, right? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. 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 That's awesome. We have to take a photo. Can I take a yes. photo? Wilson! Hey, it's Raphael. If you like college humor and want to support us, sign up for Dropout. For the low price of a whole lot of straws per month, you'll get videos like this a whole week sooner to chat with us live on the Dropout Discord and exclusive content such as Troopers. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Set a course for the Dread Cruiser. Sign up for your free trial today. You don't need all those straws. Give them to me.